The Holy Tales. Hi guys, my name is Freckles. I live here in this awesome library with my friends Gumbo and Tubby. Did you know that Jesus loved children and that he was the son of God and that he died for us? Do you know how I know all of this? Because Holy tells us wonderful stories from the Bible every day. Holy is a very old bookworm and lives in the Bible. Tubby, Gumbo, let's go, it's story time. told you that we love you very much? You tell us stories every day. Yes, Holy, you're very cool. We know so many stories because of you. Guys, you're wasting time. I want to listen to a story. Thank you, children. Okay, now sit down. Today, I will tell you a story about a woman called Lydia in Macedonia. A long time ago, Paul one of Jesus' disciples traveled to Macedonia with his companions, Silas and Timothy. He traveled from the port of Troas to the city of Philippi. Philippi was the largest city in Macedonia. Since there was no special house of God in the city, people would often gather around the river flowing outside the city gates for the Sabbath. As Paul sat there talking to the people about Jesus, he met a lady called Lydia. She wasn't a Christian, but worshipped the God of the Jews. She was a very rich lady and had a very successful business making and selling purple dye. In those days, only the very rich and powerful and kings and queens used to wear clothes made of the purple dye. It was very expensive to make this color. As Lydia sat listening to Paul, she opened her heart to the idea of Jesus and believed in him and his teachings. When Paul saw this, he was happy and immediately baptized her and her entire family. Lydia insisted that Paul and his companions should stay in their house. From then on, her house became not only a home for tired travelers, but also the first meeting place for Christians in Macedonia. This is how Paul spread Christianity in Macedonia after he had his vision. Lydia is such a nice name. From tomorrow, I will only wear purple because I want to be rich and powerful. My socks are purple and I'm not rich or powerful. My hat is purple. Children, it's more important to be good and kind than be rich. So now the question. Which was the largest city in Macedonia? I know this one. It was Philippi. Very good, Freckles. Thank you, Holy. I think we should go now and let Holy sleep. Bye, Holy. <laughs>